all of the Bowser Jr. is like siblings. They're all so ugly. I'm sure. I'm sure there's a tier list of like Bowser Jr. alts somewhere yeah. out they there. They probably put Larry up high. Look how ugly Larry is. I think that's kind of the point. You just ha you just have Larry out there, so it just tilts your opponent. And I gotta be real honest. I I don't know anything about the Shotos. Oh, uh, I except that you're not supposed to do that. Yeah, that's that's rough. That's unfortunate. Oh, and nice. He uh, did a spot dodge right there to ex avoid the explosion, but that's what uh, that's what Yanny was kind of waiting for. And Bowser Jr. is kind of a character that if you don't know how to play him, you might get body in your first game or two because he's kind of wonky. Yeah. He's got a uh, he's got one approach option, but uh, it's very good. It's a good uh, it's a good approach option. You can jump out of it. A lot of his aerials, like, they have a lot of utility. You have the fair for, like, the lingering hitbox. Nair has decent enough range. Up air is real fast. Down air, like, you know, plus, like, the projectiles. There's a lot of space he can take away from you, which allows him to use those burst options so strongly. He's scary. And pretty even percents on the stock. Um, cash a little bit down, uh, down the stock, though, but... Unfortunately, he ended up getting the, the shuttle punch with the explosion and ended up knocking him off the punish. Nice wait out right there. Wait the sure you can. I'm also interested as to why Akash plays uh, Ryu over Ken, but... Oh, Ooh. okay! Yo, okay. he just shut him down. That works. He's like, you're coming in. You're coming to me. I think that kill, but still about 140% down. Sorry, voice crack. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm going to have plenty. <laughs> Nice, kind of blocked through that. Waited for the roll behind. Didn't catch oh. to make up this deficit, but gets caught by the up air. That was weird placing right there in the air. I don't really know what he was trying to cover. Um, but Laney was able to take that like super, super nice. Gets nice. around the focus attack. It's kind of it's He's kinda, just pressuring him right now. Yeah, it's, it's kind of hard to get hit by that, but sometimes it can surprise you. Ooh, oh. nice. Almost getting that kill. That's a really interesting confirm. Nice. Keeps him off. But he's going to get back with the side B. That's bad. Yeah, that was real tough. I feel like that up B was a little bit of a panic. Yaney kind of recognizing that last time he went straight forward. Uh, Southpaw just kind of, you know, randy up B. So <laughs> you kind of see that was a bait. And he had nothing to lose either. He didn't really have to commit too hard because, you know, Southpaw is on the ledge. So pick his final destination. Um, no platforms to work around. I'm not sure how I feel about this, but uh, I hope Cash can pull something out. I I don't remember Cash doing too much, uh, like taking advantage of the uh, of the platforms very much in the uh, Pokemon Stadium. So we'll see yeah. how this goes. Well, I want to I want to see what he can do because we were kind of watching like Yanny kind of just run circles around him. And the thing is, is Ryu has really strong options on shield and stuff. So he's got to find out what he can do to kind of put Yaney in that defensive position instead of keep him on the offensive. Because, like, right there, he just immediately ended up running to, like, you know, like the corner of the stage. And when he does that, he lacks a bunch of movement options, and then Yaney can just kind of pressure him. Cash gets back, but he's really having trouble finding his way off this ledge. And just to get back with the focus attack. Once again, it's just really not giving him too much. He's just kind of staying alive right now with that stuff. He's got he's to gotta figure out a way to keep Yaney to just, like, stop moving around and just pressure him. Like a Koopa. Yeesh. I think he was hoping that would hit. Yeah, it goes straight into the forward smash. And the Koopa kind of backed smash off. Is, a good, is a good move. I don't think he should have <laughs> backed off there. I know that there is the threat of the Mecha Koopa coming in, but, like, I feel like the position that he had Yaney in was good enough. That oh, that was nice. Sorry, go on. <laughs> that like, I don't know. I, it happened. <laughs> it's gone now. <laughs> nice. Cash attack off. And Cash has been spending a lot of time off stage. He's got to figure out how to get back. And getting hit by three Mecha Koopas in a row is certainly not the way of, to do it. Well, he finally managed to get to ledge, but he's caught back again. The more important thing is that you do get back to ledge. Doesn't matter how much percent you got, because you just want to be able to win that conversion. Yeah, you don't want to die. <laughs> Finally gets back to center stage. That was nice spacing by Yaney too. I think uh, Southpaw right now is going to be kind of looking for those Shoryukens like right there, and Yaney was just kind of poking in a shield from a safe distance, fading back. So instead, he wins the race in this case. 
And it, I mean, when you ha when you're on Final Destination, you don't have Ooh. the safety of platforms to kind of put you uh, to keep you from being in a very vulnerable position as you're falling. Nice, tried Potential. to get that right there. Something I noticed. Uh, oh, okay. Akash has been doing a little bit. His uh, his like counterplay with the Mecha Koopa has been kind of weird. I don't know if he knows he can like shield it, and it'll knock it down. Or you can probably just put like one regular Shoryu, or uh, just see if if that blocks it out. I don't know. I feel like the counterplay with it has been really, really weird, and that Yaney has been able to get a lot off it. Because he's been opting more so to movement or back off. Like, see how he did that? He burned his double jump, like right there, and got hit by like the thing, and opted for like the Shoryu to keep Yaney away. When there oh, was a crumple. Does not get anything off of it though. 55% probably not, uh, definitely not going to kill, but. And not, it was not able to get any damage off of it. He's, I don't know what he's going for right now. He's getting a little thirsty. Chocolate. Shields through the forward smash. And he backed off right there. I don't know how safe that forward smash is, so I'm not going to criticize that. But Oh, and he just uh, and he just dies, gets hit with the back air, I believe. And that's my cue to go get bodied. So uh, I'll see you all in a bit. Have fun. Bye-bye.